Hello friends, in this video I will explain you how you can do drag and drop in Appium. So this applies to uh, this uh, Android as well as iPhone simulators and uh, real phones as well. So for that uh, I have got one example here, drag and drop test. So this is hypothetical example uh, but the concept wise it is you can use this uh, same structure when you are doing this drag and drop. So what we are going to do here is there are two elements battery and uh, say sound. Now what we want to do is we want to drag battery onto the sound. So how you can do that. So there are two elements you want to drag one element on the other. So this is straightforward you can find the element by any uh, element location strategy. Once you find the two elements this is source element and this is destination battery source sound is destination let us say. Then you have to use two classes. One is touch action. This touch action class is in this uh, package. I will APM Java client and another class that you want to use multi touch action that is again in the same package. So touch action and multi touch action. These two classes you have to use uh, to do this drag and drop. So basically what we want to do is we want to this touch action class first and then build this action. So what we want to do is we want to press this battery element then wait for some time and then drag it uh, so move through element move method is used to drag that element on to another element so here we you can see that we are use the sound dot get location dot get x so what we are doing here is we are getting the x and y coordinates of the destination element here we are getting the uh, x and y coordinates of the source element that is battery element and meanwhile we are waiting here we are pressing uh, that source element then waiting for some time this is uh, specifically one second and then dragging this using the mutual element uh, sorry mutual method so here a drag and drop operation it is just building the action now to perform this action we have to use multi touch action multi touch action is used when there are multiple uh, actions are there you can see there is a chain of actions here there is a press action then wait action and move to action so there are three actions that there so and that's the reason we are using multi touch action in multi touch action uh, you can add the action that we have built so this action we have built so we are adding that action and then uh, this method is required to do actual operation dot perform so at the end of this uh, line the drag and drop operation would have been performed so that is how you can use this drag and drop operation in uh, APM. So this applies to Android as well as iPhone. The syntax wise uh, everything is same. So basically uh, you have to get the source elements coordinates and destination elements coordinates and then uh, just use this chain of actions, press, wait, action, move to. That's it. If you have more questions or you are uh, faced or uh, in issues with this uh, drag and drop, let me know through the comments. Thank you for watching this video.